Hi there, welcome to in this tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to add a sticky cart or add to cart button in your Shopify online store. So this tutorial will be very helpful if you are looking a solution to add a sticky add to cart button or buy now button. So then you can continue this tutorial. We can using a free app without any coding skills. So this tutorial will be very helpful for you if you wanted to increase your conversion and redo abandoned cart. So let's get started. So here are the apps that I am going to use in this tutorials, and it is very popular. This apps is developed by Quickify, Sticky Card plus uh, Sticky Add to Card button. It's completely free. There is no any cost for this app. And here are the app featured: Add Sticky Card to Desktop or Mobile. Choose Position to Display. Go to cart page or checkout. Open mini cart. Show the number of item in the cart. Adjust color size and icon. And a sticky add to cart bar. You can also add a sticky add to cart bar. Add to desktop or mobile display on the top or bottom of this page. Show variant to select. Go to the shopping cart page or go to start or to checkout. Change bar height, color, font. And in the mini cart, three type of mini cart bubble of canvas sidebar model or pop-up so set mini cart position show go to the cart or check out button adjust color font size so we need we actually no need any coding skill to enable this in our shopify online store we can do this without any coding skill so let me show you how we can add this in our store so i am going to log in so this is my online store dashboard or admin panel and I'm going to click on the app button then click on the visit the Shopify app store button at the top uh, right side now I'm going to search this app at here then click on the search button and we get this one right here so i'm going to click on the title of this app then click on the add app button now click on the install app and from here we can enable on desktop enable on mobile here our sticky button you can look at my mouse then we can change button action from the general section where it should go show cut counter show button shadow position in the desktop position in middle and you can change it still from here icon font size everything so easy is mini cut okay and here the sticky bar look at the bottom of the set then click on the create okay we have done now going to visit my website and then click on the add a product add to cart look at here in the sticky cart in the add to cart bar right here we can change this add to cart bar sticky bar colors from here for example bar background color okay we have changed this one now refresh oh we have add this so thank you for your time if you think this tutorial is helpful for you and save your money and time then click on the like button and subscribe to my channel